Well, I, I guess it, it is a bit mixed feelings, isn't it? You, you come back into the team, you want to play, you play well, but when you don't get the win, it just it takes the edge off it, doesn't it? Yeah, I think, um, to be honest, the most important thing is always getting getting the result that we want, getting a win, you know, so obviously regardless of the performance, which I did think was a good effort, um, we have to look at we have to look at ourselves and obviously look what we can do to push on and get like, get those wins, try and be consistent with getting getting good results. I guess it just shows you how ruthless it is. The, the further up the the leagues you go, you make a little mistake every now and again, and it can cost you. Yeah, I think I think that's one of the one of the main differences. To be fair, um, it's like teams are teams are going to punish you. You know, teams are going to punish you on the counter attack, and teams are very good going forward in this league. So. Yeah, that's one of the, that's one of the um, differences that I've seen. Yeah, absolutely. So um, nice to be back out on the pitch, and I guess showing a bit of patience isn't a lot of this squad are going to have to do. You've got a lot of good players, and, and you're not going to be playing every week. Yeah, and um, we got. I think we've got a really good squad over here. You know, there is there is a lot of a lot of players from most positions in this team, and it does make it it does make it um it makes good it breeds good competition. You know, and um, I think I see like myself. I've seen myself out of the team. Not playing for a couple of weeks, and you just need to you need to come back in and show what you can do, and prove as to why you should be should be playing. Yeah, and imagine that makes t training quite tasty, isn't it? Because you got a lot of players there wanting to show that they're worthy of a place in the team. Yeah, definitely. There's always um, a lot of competition. Like that's one of the that's one of the main things the manager implements. To be fair, um, making sure there's higher competition in in the team. Like whatever, whenever we're doing like small sided games and matches. See, there's always something on it. It's always for a run or it's for something. So I think that's good going into when we play our games because you have that kind of not wanting to lose mentality. Yeah. And this weekend, Northampton, I'd imagine you probably came up against them when you were at Plymouth last year. Yeah, um, I did actually play them at their place. And they're a good team. They're definitely a good team, but I think it's not a team that we should go showing too much respect. You know, I think... I think I haven't I haven't seen a team yet in this in this division that I thought they're a lot better than us or they they are they're better than us at all, to be fair. Like we're going into games and we're doing well in games, but it's just about getting that consistency as I said before. And and after this match you got a little bit of a break with the uh, the international break and not mm. playing that weekend. So, you know, it, you don't want to go into that on the back of something that's gonna leave you a bad taste in your mouth. You wanna go into it on a real positive, don't you? Yeah, definitely. I think we wanna go Go into the international break on a positive note. You know, hopefully get get a win, and then we can all recharge, get a little rest, and then come back and go again.